Hi, Cher. Hi, Pedro. Yeah, he's not just any dog. Ben the French Bulldog is like a family member to the Sanchez family, so you could imagine how heartbroken they were to find out that he had been stolen from their Chevy Tahoe in the parking lot of this very busy shopping center right behind me here in Hesperia. They're hoping anyone with information will come forward. They say he's got black fur, brown eyes. One of his ears doesn't go up all the way because he recently had a blood clot and he was last seen wearing a baby blue collar. He would greet me. He would I would play with him when I got home just to get a phone call and say, oh, he's gone. Like, you know, it hurts, you know. <laughs> he was a source of laughter and joy for the Sanchez family. They got their French bulldog Ben as a puppy in 2018. <laughs> the reason why we got my my dog was because my parents were going through a divorce. So, you know, me and my brother were you know, just so down, so we didn't know what to do. So Ben, you know, when we got Ben, he brought that like um, that warm in our hearts. You could imagine how devastated Amarani Sanchez was to learn that their beloved Ben was taken from them Sunday and in this Hesperia parking lot. She says her mom had come to do some Christmas shopping at Ross. Meanwhile, her dad stayed in the car with Ben. My mom was done shopping at Ross. My mom calls my dad saying, hey, I'm going to go to Target real quick. And my dad told my mom, okay, cool, I'm gonna get off the car real quick to go use the restroom. But when he came back, this is what he found. A shattered window and Ben gone. The crazy thing is that my parents had Christmas gifts inside the car, so they didn't take nothing but my dog. The car next to them had also been broken into. It's the latest in a series of criminals targeting the popular pups that often come with a high price tag. Just this month, a pregnant woman was held at gunpoint in Studio City before a suspect stole her two French bulldogs. For Amarani and her family, they're heartbroken. I've been on Facebook, I've been on Instagram. Hoping for any tips that will lead them to Ben. He was a family dog, you know, it's like losing a, a family member. Now, Amarani has been uh, receiving tips all day. She even got a call from someone saying that they thought they saw a man boarding a bus with a dog that looked like Ben. So she naturally went out and started following some of those buses, but still no luck. Right now, the family is offering a cash reward, but we did speak to Hesperia police. They say they don't have any information either. They are reviewing surveillance video, but unfortunately, no suspect descriptions. Reporting live in Hesperia, I'm Shelby Nelson, KTLA 5 News. Shelby, thank you.